Oh, hurry, everyone, and welcome aboard. That'll be your Captain Hillian tonight, along with. He is a mighty lieutenant. Rakeel, at your service, and. Wait. Yes, I had lunch. Okay, w welcome back to Sonic Rush Adventure. Um, okay, why is the. Wait. I think I. There we go. Okay, for some. <laughs> it wasn't reacting because it wasn't like that. Yeah. Welcome to Sonic Rush Adventure. Uh, yeah, right off the bat, uh, these two are getting themselves into trouble again. Yeah, I feel like we would read this if it isn't also. Yeah, it's going rather uh, fast. Uh, people can see here. <laughs> Easy for you to yeah. say. <laughs> uh, Tails doesn't clap back to Sonic that often, but it was a good one. Oh, yeah, I, I think I missed that. What did you say? Easy for you to say in, in response to do something, Tails, or something like that. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, and what's this? It's true. <laughs> I think they're dead. Uh, uh, Tails, are you alright? Ow. I think so. Boy, there was some storm, huh, Sonic? Oh, blimey, you're alive. <laughs> she sounds so disappointed with that. Huh? Who are you? Mind yourself, mate. Ask in a Sheila's name and you ain't giving your own first. Oh boy, we landed in Australia. What? Oh, I... I'm sorry. My name is Tails. I mean, jeez. And I'm Sonic. Sonic the Hedgehog. Cheers! My name's Marine. What's this? I come down here, save your lives, and even a thank you? What? Uh, thank you, miss. Ah, well, she'll be apples. I'm more interested in how you managed to find this island. Crikey, you don't... you didn't swim here, did you? Hey, that's a good question. Do we even know where we are, Sonic? Yeah, do we even know where we are, Sonic? Hmm. So your name's Marine, huh? What is this place? This is Seagull Beach, near Windmill Village. You got any questions? I'm your gal, mate. After all, nothing goes on around these parts without me knowing about it first, mate. As for Seagull Beats, well, I named it after the heaps of seagulls around here. <laughs> Points three looks to Drakir. Moot's <laughs> art nemesis is seagulls. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't it just Ripper? Uh, uh. Tails, do you have any idea where this windmill village is? No, I've never even heard of it. I wonder where this island even is. That's true. You don't even know where Southern Island is. It's in the middle of the ocean. Well, that much I already figured out. Sonic, what should we do? Well, maybe the folks in this windmill village can give us some clue as to where we are. What? You want to come to my village? Well, then my house is your house. Thanks, Marine. <laughs> One day later... <laughs> Uh, yeah, there's going to be a lot more story in this game. You could say that Sonic Rush was the prototype... Uh, well, the, uh, <laughs> it was already a bit experimental with some things. Trying to translate the Sonic Advance stuff to the DS and such. But this one is a lot more talky <laughs> as well. <clears throat> hmm? Hey, looks like somebody's been hurt. Looks like somebody's hurt. Sonic, is Marine. Hey, Marine, are you alright? Ah, that, there it goes again. I really thought I had finally gotten it right. Marine, what are you doing? You blind there, mate? I'm about to launch my pal here, the good old SS Marine. Last time, though, I made a few blues and things went a bit crook, you know? Yeah, she, <laughs> Marine is very, very Australian. I think... Actually, I'm going to send this video to, the, to Beanie to see how he reacts to it, since he is Australian. Yeah. Yeah, to see how 
Like, and like, if they're gonna be too hard or they are spot or whatever for... I have heard some people go a little bit... When they try to make an Australian character, they either go a bit too soft or a bit too hard on it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but you'll be right then, won't you, mate? There ain't no one on the seven seas who cannot run. Ah, now we've got some gas going. I don't really like the look of this. Well, yikes! <laughs> Can't you keep that thing straight? No worries, mates. Really, I've got everything under control here. Holy <laughs> dooly, come on, Marine. I'm the one who built you. Stop being so stubborn. Sonic tells enough with the bludgering. Come here and help me. Wait, me? Show weakness? No drama. <laughs> Let me just hit the brake here and... Hey, hold on a sec. That's the... The gas. <laughs> and yeah, things are also a lot more animated, huh? <laughs> uh, my my precious little baby, looks what look what's become of you. No, oh, what should I do? I can't rebuild her now. There's no way I can fix this. It's okay, Marine. Tell you what, why don't you let me build a new ship for you? No, it's no use. Hey, trust me. When it comes to building things, Tails is number one. Yeah, honestly, I put you know, things like this together all the time. No, it's no use. There aren't any minerals left anyway. Hmm? What do you mean? The place I always go to get my building stuff has been blocked off, mate. I don't know exactly what happened, but the trail is blocked by boulders. Ah, and I, I can't get away from this place. I'll be stuck here my whole life. I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm going to drop her here. I have to get out. I'm not going to try and give her an actual Australian accent because, well, I'll murder my throat. <laughs> so, like, what should we do? Hmm. Well, I guess that sells it. I'll get you what you need. Fair dinkum? But the trail is blocked off. How will you? No problem. I'll just blaze my own trail. Let's leave it to Sonic. He always comes through. Well, all right, but come on, let's go, Marine. So, what sort of materials do you need exactly? Let's see, there should be some stuff laying around. Ah, Ooh, pardon, I'm just back from dinner. Mm. This is what we need. Look for jewels or metal like this. Then I can give it a roll of putting it together. Hmm? Hey, Marine, what are you looking at? Is it a book about ships? <laughs> Steals it from her. <laughs> I think we should show this to Tails first. Come on. Can I look at this for a bit, Marine? He says, already reading it. Okay. Hmm. It's a book on shipbuilding. It talks about using metals and jewels called materials. Wow, I've never heard of constructing a ship with stuff like this before. <laughs> Looks like you need both metals and jewels to build the whole ship. I get it. Blimey! Oops, can you understand that? You're a fair dinkum genius! No, that's nothing. Okay then, I'll head out and get the materials we need. Okay, good luck, Sonic. Be careful! Where? <laughs> And time to change the scene! Yep, which I'm going to try and pay a lot more attention to. Okay. Sonic, since we're in a new place, do you want to practice your moves? Yeah, this is one thing I like with this game as well, is it actually puts in a tutorial for moves. Let's go through them quickly. Okay. Left and right, walk in a direction. Hold and you'll run. I can't... Oh, yeah, Absolutely so basic comments. stuff, but it does it does it does show us a bit more. Hmm. And sorry, I was interrupting you. I said I have so many comments already from all this. <laughs> yeah, okay. After the tutorial, you can let them all out. The thing in front of you is a loop. To move through the loop, just hold in the direction you want to go. In this case, just hold left, left, right on the D-pad to make it through the loop. 
Yeah, ap apparently this is something that got a lot of people stuck in the old uh, games. That yeah, people thought that you had to change direction in the middle of a loop, causing them to fall out every time. There you go. A or B to jump. Land on top. And it's lethal. Yeah, way to go. R will jump to perform a jump dash. Just a boost forwards. Okay, down, and then hold down to start spinning. For a spin dash. And go. <laughs> Not that fast, though. Um, the longer you hold it, the faster you'll go, probably. When jumping from springs or other gadgets, press B again to perform a trick action. Performing multiple tricks in a row will result in a combo. Press re B repeatedly, and then press A to receive a trick bonus. Try it out. Okay. Yeah, we need to press A to actually land correctly now, I'm pretty sure. Like, if I only press B... Okay, still gets points, but less than... Okay, so you'll still get points all the same whether you press to land or not. And here we go, a bit more. A hop jump. Get a bit more air. Way to go. Sideways dash. There we go. And yeah, apparently that the thing on the side is the tension gauge, not the boost gauge, as I incorrectly identified it. At the tail, you'll be able to plow right through enemies and obstacles. Yeah. Simple as that. This must be the place that Marine said was all blocked off. And we just boost through. Looks like you got the hang of things. And yeah, at the end of every stage, we'll now find a, a chest from which we'll get materials. And Rain, uh, I brought you a little present. Theme. Go ahead. Scene. Yeah. Hey. Hmm. <laughs> oh my gosh, really? No big deal, really. Hmm. Collect we've got blue material. And also some iron material. With these, I think I can build a water bike. But Bob's your uncle! A water bike? For real? <laughs> yeah. Booty! Yeah. Not sure I said <laughs> I that correctly. Sonic, did you hear that? A water bike. That's Pearl. It sounds so cool. And Ring, calm down. It's okay. Yeah, anyhow, mate. Tails, let's get going. Y yeah, okay, sure. Just wait for me, Rain Marine. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay, oh, we automatically God. move here. And, yeah, we'll have a bit of a hub area here. Where we can well, talk with everyone here. Hey, you got the materials. This might take a while, so why did you uh, save your game first? The fourth wall is completely gone. To save your game, press Y to open the menu, then press and then select save. Oi, tell Tails to hurry up and make that water bike. Be <laughs> patient, Marine. And over here, well, there couldn't be any more Australian than the koala. Good day, nice to meet you. My name is Setter. If you want to change your game options, then come see me. And this over here. It's actually for the multiplayer. But yeah, I'm running on an emulator anyway, so no multiplayer. But yeah, let's see. Options. We can set the boss difficulty, time limit, and if needed, we can even clear out the data. Uh, let's set that to normal. Guess, well, <laughs> we got through Sonic Rush on normal through everything except for the final boss with Blaze. Two final bosses. I'm not sure if it counted for the final one, but uh, if it <laughs> if that was if there was a difference there, then well, we would not have been able to finish it last time. Uh, let's leave those off for the moment. Okay. And yeah, if need be, we can just turn the difficulty back down to easy. Yeah, all right, I was. Speak about my comments I had earlier. Yep. Yeah. Uh, the beat scene really proved 
them with a stick, Marie. Yeah. I feel like the, the, I feel like okay. There's a me moment. Ooh, me poking you, but <laughs> especially when both Sonic and Tails. I almost called them Fox for some reason. <laughs> both made two sounds that you often do. No. <laughs> uh, uh. <laughs> These are way too iconic for you, for you have done those sounds at times. Uh, okay, let's see. I'll get started on the water bike right away. Wait just a little bit. You. Uh, there you go. Yeah, I'm going to need to keep an eye on that quite a bit during all of this. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad to help. <laughs> water bike wave cyclone complete. So finished, Sonic. Now travel aboard the water bike. Okay, uh -oh. automatically move over. Oh, I should have forget. I did hit Mr. Seagulls. I was pondering how many guns did I bring with me? Okay, <laughs> did anyone else hear some sort of pop sound there for a sec? I did not hear a pop sound. Okay, odd. Uh, let's see. Wow, the water bike's all clean. Good on you, Tails. <laughs> you like it? It's amazing that you can make stuff like this out of materials. It's the first time I've seen this technology that combines jewels and metals. But once you get the hang of it, it's not that difficult. And there's all kinds of different materials too. So you can use different combinations to make bigger ships like sailboats. In short, if we collect different materials, we'll be able to head further and further out. Enough with the chin wagging, you lot. Let's give it a roll, eh? First off, let's go explore that island. That island? Yeah, that's right. I grew up always scratching my head over what's, um, yeah, what's on that there island. It's the perfect start heading point for my adventures. It's that island to the west of here, right? Well, it's not that far, so it'll be a good test run for the water bike. All right. Maybe there'll be uh, there'll uh, be some new material to find too. Here begin the adventures of Captain Marine. All right, <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> yeah, Marine is very enthusiastic. Okay. I would Set say energetic, maybe lively. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You need to use the stylus to draw your ship's route. Touch this uh, touch screen with the stylus when set. Yeah, we actually get to plan our own routes with this. <laughs> this is a map of the world. You can use this to draw a route to your destination. <laughs> Zoom in. In the center is Southern Island, where we are now. Look for other places. You can make the map scroll by sliding the stylus. Give it a try, Sonic. Okay. We can just I click and drag like this. That damn thing is called stylus. <laughs> yep. Okay, your audio, your mic quality just dropped for us for some reason. Oh, but, but I did lean a bit too cl uh, far away, I guess. Yeah. Okay, that was that. Uh, hey, you can... I said I only recently got to learn what the heck a stylus is. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's it. You seem to have a good, a pretty good hang of moving the map screen, Sonic. Now let's draw our routes. Let's set a, a course for the island Marine told us about. Touch that point and drag a line to the island to the left. Give it a try. Okay. Yeah, we can do this. And yeah, as you can see in the upper left, we have a maximum amount that we can go with this. Good job. Now touch that. Oh, the, the circle. The okay circle. Is this okay? Yes. All right. I think you've got. Uh, yeah, I think you've pretty much got the hang of it. Now let's set sail for One Piece. Uh, yes, I know it's up there, but the action is going to be down here. Oh no, not that! Set sail with a water bike. Sails. <laughs> okay. Control the ship with the stylus. When the stylus is ready, touch the touch screen. Sonic, since this is your first time riding this craft, do you want to know the controls? Let's do it uh, to be certain. 
I remember that some of these missions can be a bit... Um, basically, we'll have to do this whenever we travel with any sort of craft, though how they, um, the things we need to do do differ each time. <clears throat> uh, I don't remember them being too tough, but if need be, I can mess with the game speeds if it gets too tough at any point, though I don't think it should. Just in, uh, if anything, I'll probably have to do that for collecting the Chaos Emeralds, and nothing more than that. There we go. Touch the screen to make the auto pack accelerate. Start by touching a few times to get going. So yeah, basically I click, Sonic goes. That's it, Sonic looks like you got the hang of it. And yeah, he moves wherever I hold this. By sliding the status left and right, you can steer in that direction. Yep, collect the rings. And to there, you're natural. <laughs> okay. If you hit a ramp, you can jump up into the air. Trace the markers with the stylus to perform tricks. Make sure you trace in the right direction. Now hit a ramp and try to perform a trick. Oh dear. Also, do I sound better now? Yeah. Yeah, then I... My shit is a bit further away from the disc at the moment, I just moved my closer. I think... What happened earlier was I was leaning in the chair with my hand, head resting against my face. I mean, too far away from my earlier. Okay. By, perform by performing tricks, the boost in the upper right corner will fill up. If you quickly trap this, uh, tap the uh, stylus twice, you can activate your boost. You can also press left uh, or right shoulder buttons. Okay, that'll oh, make it easier for me. <laughs> Captain Man <laughs> overboard! <laughs> Hello, Rom. Uh, let me move you over quickly. Uh, <laughs> there. <laughs> so how's everybody doing tonight? <laughs> doing well. <laughs> doing well, yeah. Okay. There, just scoot you over. It'll probably get a bit cramped over here with this, unless you're okay with <laughs> dipping into the water a bit. God. <laughs> okay, there we go. Oh yeah, how are you, Rom? Uh, I'm doing fine. <laughs> okay, that's um, good to hear. Come to the moment. Hmm? I'm pretty sure this is like the first dream I've been of Sonic. Uh, yeah, I think so. Okay, let me put this on top again. There we go. There you go. Oh. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> now, no ear biting, okay? <laughs> okay. Bye. <laughs> While boosting, you're invincible. Not more him to you, Rom. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> you can defeat enemies by slamming into them. If your boost runs out, or if you remove the stylus, then boost will end. Use boost to defeat those enemies, Sonic. How do you remove boost in a game where, you know, you're not using a stylus? Uh, I... I'm just holding the controller in the in my left hand, since I can also activate it with uh, the shoulder buttons on the controller. Ah. Mm. If you hit an enemy using, uh, if you hit an enemy when you're not boosting or doing a trick, he will take damage. This bar in the upper left shows how much damage your ship can take. If the gauge runs out, then your voyage will be over. So be extra careful. Now let's work on some of those techniques that you've just learned. And yeah, we all know how Sonic is with water, so him being stranded out in the middle of the bloody ocean... Uh... Not a good thing. Mm. Yep. Oh dear. Okay. Okay. Thank you all set, now let's head for that island. Uh -oh. Okay. And now we finally get going. Okay. And I think we'll have a sandwich or two. Boost pass. So, Rom, make sure yeah. uh, the cat that doesn't drown, all right? Don't drown. Okay. There we go. I do believe the arrows will show you the general direction that the, the trick will be on the ramps. Oh, uh, well. <laughs> Okay, and there we are. 
Hey, that's a lot of rings collected. <laughs> okay. Sonic, we've reached the island. Let's land. So where the heck are you a marine on this thing? <laughs> then again, Tails can fly. He's probably carrying her along. The jungle, eh? Oh, that's beautiful. What's up? So, hmm? is she like... A marine, or is her name just marine? Also, her name is marine. Uh, <laughs> uh, right. I can fall off the table. <laughs> I, I see what happened here. Give me a sec. Uh, there. There you go. I him off. Okay, where? Up there. Uh, copy. And uh, might as well put you on both of these at once, then. Yeah. Paste. There. And... Right. Paste. There we go. Okay. Uh, now back to this one. Okay. Marine, don't wander off by yourself. I need to select the emulator again before the controller actually registers. Sonic Tails, look, don't these your mushrooms look tasty? They're all over the place. <laughs> hey, uh, Marine. No worries, mate. No worries. I'll stick with... Uh, I'll stick with Kui. Uh, if that's supposed to be something, I have no freaking clue what it is. Man, she's hopeless. At any rate, where are we, Sonic? I've never seen anything like this. I think we need to go out and gather some more information. Yeah, I hope that we can find something here on this island. Hey, Marine, come on, let's go. Sonic, wait. <laughs> I just saw the keenest thing. Don't you want to hear about it? Mm, no, not really. Of course you do, mate. There's these mushrooms bigger than my house. The outside world has so much ace stuff in it. I'm having so much fun, I'm nearly knackered. Oh, so you can notice that uh, their expressions change even when they're not well, being lit up. <laughs> the world isn't just fun in games, Marine. You've got to be uh, you've got to be careful too. You. Oh, hey, I have an idea. Why don't we call this here place Marine Island, eh? <laughs> that way we can com yeah, com commemorate our arriving here on our very first adventure. <laughs> She's not listening. So a word we're saying. Right. Damn. Okay. Let's do it. Here we go. Okay. Oh, 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 that Marine hmm. might be related to like, the captain. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but you both like sailing, and you both like mushrooms. Yep. <laughs> okay. There we go. We can also do that boost sideways. Okay, if I remember correctly, most of the areas in most of the areas in this game are going to have uh, more unique differences. Uh, yep. Nope. Yep. Okay, for a moment I thought I fell into an abyss there. <laughs> what the? There we go. <laughs> and apparently even the, the trees are helping us. Okay, that's not anywhere near high enough to jump on there. Okay. Yep. Accidentally jumped off that. Okay, let's keep going. Oop, quite a boost from that one. Okay, and wherever this place is, Eggman has been here already. And yeah, we get these little <laughs> bits here as well. For all we know, this could be one of his many old uh, factories that have been hidden around. Yeah. And let's see, what do we get? First, a scoring, of course. Yes. 
B for bacon. Okay. Two green material. I do believe that the amount of material that you get is dependent on the rank. Okay, act two. Ready? Let's do it. Okay. Okay, I forget if there is some sort of trick you can do at the start there to get a boost like in racing games and such. Yep. Nope. Okay, I got lucky with the bounces there. Oop. Shields? These were missing from the first rush. Or just elemental shields. And ele the electric or lightning shields, whatever it be accurately called, those attract rings nearby, as you can see them uh, <laughs> saw that they were getting drawn in. Uh, these? Okay, I was half expecting to have to jump up somewhere there. Okay. Oop. Anything up? I almost fell off that. Oop. And I failed that. Oh well. Oop. <laughs> okay, I need to not fail this then. There. Another help. Oop. Oop. There we go. I think I may have ideas what the boss is gonna be. <laughs> uh, big three. Uh, uh, oh, uh, more of what I see from the robot singer. I, I know there's a theme. <laughs> Dinos. It's gonna be a damn T Rex, ain't it? Or something. Uh... What a horrifying... <laughs> no spoilers for me. Okay, more green material. in the next level look he already well that was the second act and well, boss is always the third here we go oh right uh, well that <laughs> call it out and yeah one big difference that you can see already is uh, no longer is this health bar a set amount of hits it's a full health bar so yeah I don't know if that's a good or bad thing, because it's a Sonic game. Mm. I will pray it's a good thing. Okay. Yeah, it, it shouldn't make things too different. Also, just needs the E3D bit here. They will, of course, get more aggressive and pull out new tricks at certain points. Or certain percentages. I almost got hit there, I think. But yeah, already quite a bit of an upgrade with uh, the graphics on over the first game, I'd say. Ooh, yeah. What the? <laughs> Okay, I think it actually changed to... Oh, right. <laughs> this stupid ass move. What the? <laughs> okay, I, I think I hit the transition button at, like, at the perfect moment with that. And I kind of actually forgot that the transition's down. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go again with the long neck. What the heck? The... <laughs> <laughs> I 
and Sonic's dead. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, we get materials even from the bosses. Okay, I will likely have to grind out some of these for a bit at some point or another. Because we're likely to just run short at some point or another, but I'll try to do that off stream if possible. <clears throat> G'day, Sonic. Did you find any more material? Sure did. Take a look. Ace! Now we can use this here to make ourselves a sailboat, eh? Well, not just yet. We still need some additional material. Who's there? What? Is someone there? Hi, I know that voice. Oh, hey, Marine. How are you? G'day, Cobber. Haven't seen you in forever, mate. Cobber? Hi, Tabby's a member of our village, uh, the village's youth association. We call it the Coconut Crew. Yeah, well, anyway, fancy meeting you here. Are these your buddies? Yep, these blokes here are my assistants. <laughs> Sonics and Tails. Assistants? <laughs> are you searching for material? You're right. Tails here says that he can build us a real boat and beautiful boat, mate. Speaking of which, we really do need to get on with our search for minute material. In that case, you might want to sail southwest. There's an island made up of machines. Machine island? We can probably get some metal material there, I bet. Alright then, Let's look, uh, looks like we've got ourselves a new destination. Okay, time to launch then. Let's mosey you blokes. Wow, she's really getting into this whole thing. <laughs> yeah. Marine is basically what you'd get if uh, you locked cream in her room and gave her too much sugar. Uh, uh, phrasing. Okay. Wait, what? I can come up with a better line, so just phrasing. Oh, is oh, it, yeah. oh, what is it, grazing? Phrasing. <laughs> okay, you just confused me as to why you said that, but okay. <laughs> All right. Next destination. Okay, we can start off from uh, new points. Uh, there are new islands that we've already been to, that, that we've been to, and gotten to, whatever. So, yeah, we can travel over here to this island. We can explore around, of course, to other places that are likely to have islands. Like, probably something over here, over there. But for the moment, let's just go where the game suggests us to go. Some oh, places we wouldn't be able to get to anyways. Also, I'm, I'm so glad that Marine cannot fly like Cream. <laughs> uh, if she could, she wouldn't have been stuck on this island for so long. Eagles! Okay. But yeah, we'll be seeing this minigame for quite a bit. Oop, there we go. Or quite a bit, quite often. Since, well, we'll have to travel around quite a lot. Okay, a bit more of a trickier one. Luckily, they okay. shouldn't take too long. Yeah. Catch another one in, in midair. Okay. I think I heard that actually is technology they use metal and crystals, but not in what you see in sci-fi or fantasy. Definitely mm -hmm. tuned down compared to those, but I think it's kind of still experimental. Okay. Yeah, let's land. Struths, it really is an island of machines. Have you ever seen anything like that? Hmm, looks like it's all steam powered. Very impressive. Hey, what's this handle do? Hmm, it's stuck and I can't turn it. Marine, watch out. That could be dangerous, so don't touch it. No drama, mate, no drama. <laughs> Here's another one, but it won't budge either. 
I wonder what this island is designed to do. Hmm. Well, I can't tell for sure, but it seems to be some certain some kind of steam contraption. First there was a jungle, and now we're not in this island. There's a lot of weird stuff here. Right, and since anything could happen, we should all be we should all be extra careful. Yeah, that goes for you too, Marine. Okay. Long gone, Marine. <laughs> She's gone. So then, what should we do? Oh, she really is hopeless. After all the talk about being careful too. Okay, that's the third part they have uh, the marine has in common with the captain. <laughs> He's running off. Oh yes, <laughs> into trouble. <laughs> okay. Second stage. So let's see how quickly we can go through this. Uh, yeah, one thing I think you'll be happy about with this game is that the music is a lot less hip hoppy. Uh, I'm okay with hip hop. But the music here so far fits, I feel like, fits the game so far and with the environment. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. Keep on going, and we'll see where we end up. Okay, I, I think I might have been remembering this level when I was thinking about if the uh, the steam bursts in the previous game would yeah, would cause harm or not, since, well, we're very obviously not getting harmed by them. Oh. But apparently now it's Flappy Sonic. Yeah, you see... But look like theme powered terminators. Uh, yep. Oop, right back. Okay, I have to say I'm not much of a fan of those back and forth bits. Okay, oop. There we go. Hmm. Oop, again with this. Oop. Yep, uh, I'm pretty sure I, I filled the shortcut there. Oop. And I, I think I saw something hidden down there, but... Oh well. Act done. Pressure! Yes. Okay, that gets us some bronze material. Okay. Okay, Act 2 of the Machine Labyrinth. Let's do it. Okay. Yeah, I'll have... Yeah, missed that one. I'll have to double-check if there is something to uh, get a boosted start or not. Oop. Getting that. But the shield is just too useful to skip. Oop. Okay. Yep. Okay. So these will blast you out of the hang glider. Oop. Oop. Oh. Oh, really? Those, those things only blast you with steam? Okay. Um... Neil? Hmm? Have to say that again. Yeah, they, oh, it, it's still they steam, but in this case it doesn't harm. Um... I got nothing. <laughs> they, it's... <laughs> You're, you ran out of steam with your jokes. You're giving fuel here wrong. Uh, let's see. Uh, if you have to... Oh, bloody... Bloody hey, I, I, I know I no, cannot escape you there, what I'm gonna say. If you blow steam on someone, they will get stalling. Yeah. Okay. I'm, I know, it sounded like I made a pun. <laughs> Oop, God damn it. There. Okay. So yeah, those things should hurt, but luckily enough they don't, for this at least. Oop. Okay, 
down this way. Okay. Get a bit of you as well. Okay. Those red ones are really freaking lanky. That's a level. We're not, not a level. Well, I think, uh, think you call them uh, punk terminators. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure that the term lanky does not apply to any terminator. Not really. Well, actually, it might technically apply to the T1000 when you think about it. And yeah, the liquid one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it kinda lanky until, until you put flesh on them. Well, they're giant skeletons made of metal. True. Marine, there you are. What did we tell you about being careful? Hey, you want to know a fun fact? Hmm? Oh? You, have you ever heard of the game Terminator Resistance? Uh, yeah. I that... think I have, but not in a good way. It's actually a good game, believe it or not. Anyways, uh... What happens is that... A side mode in the game called Infiltrator Mode has you play as a Terminator. Even down to getting like the pistol from the first game. From the first movie, I mean. And... Fuck, what am I thinking? Oh yeah, he's based off the guy who shows up in Kyle Reese's flashback dream nightmare sequence of the Terminator assaulting the base. Who is actually... I think a friend of Arnold Schwarzenegger, who was also his stunt double at the time. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, let me... Resist... Yeah, Resistance is one of the shooters, right? And it also has the infiltrator terminators that... It will infiltrate the Resistance and such. Uh, oh, wait. I think it was the series of... of it. Wasn't that a series with the same name? Could be. I'm not yeah, too deep in the uh, Terminator franchise. Same. I, I don't recall there has been some attempts on making the series, and those that have come out, they were rather not liked or meh or something like that. Hmm. Yeah, from what I remember, there was a recent Terminator, not recent, but like five, maybe ten years back, a Terminator game. That was... people didn't expect much of, but turned out to be a lot more competent than people had you know, thought that it would be. That's Terminator Resistance. That's the one I'm talking about. All right. Okay. And there was also a recent... Uh, <clears throat> there was also a recent RTS game, which people are a bit more 60-40 on. Like, it's hard as balls, but some people like that. <clears throat> <laughs> Okay, let's continue. Oh, Sonic and Tails, where have you two been? I've been worried sick about you blokes. What are you talking about? You were the one that took off. Yeah, it's dangerous to be out here by, by yourself. <laughs> something, something, take this. <clears throat> don't, don't chunk a wobbly. You blokes get stressed out too easily. I don't think I've ever heard any pr any British person say chunk of wobbly or something uh, like that. It's Australian. Ah, uh, Australian. Yeah. yeah. I, I haven't heard that phrase either. <laughs> Ooh, what's that, mate? That's floating thing. Looks fun. Hmm? Come on, Sonic. Let's have a go at it. It'll be a real <laughs> rip snorter. Just hold it a sec, Marine. If anyone's having any fun, it's going to be me. Ah, oh, Sonic, that's not fair. Tails, what's Marine for me? Okay, Sonic, be careful. No, I want to go too. Okay. Oh. Yep. Let's do it. It's a boss that requires the stacked scene. I... I was expecting Robotnik. There we go, and uh, yeah, why? Stop hitting yourself. Stop hitting yourself. <laughs> okay, I think if we wait long enough. Oh. 
Okay, okay there's more balls coming to play now. Okay, so that's how it is going to attack. I'm pretty sure these are going to do something eventually as well. Okay, if we miss them on the swing back though... Ooh. There, it, yeah. If we <laughs> if we wait too long, they will form spikes to damage us with. Okay. Still, yeah. Okay. Good thing I missed that. Almost. Oh, come on. Yeah. And ah oh, well. There we go. That missed. Okay. There. I have okay. a very hard time to commentate on this fight without the... You know, the reveal of the... Like, uh... Like, uh... Like, say phrasing. <laughs> But uh, no, yeah, no comments on me uh, just hitting this thing's balls over and over. I feel like that's a joke. Like, <laughs> no, no, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> yeah, have you guys seen Red vs. Blue? Yeah, not the, the entirety of it, but that's because there's like what, 20 seasons at the end now. I think I've seen some clips, but not really watched it. Yeah, 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 I'm sure what happened there. What go on? In Red vs. Blue, there's a large fight scene in which one of the characters, Griff, gets constantly hit in the nuts. <laughs> oh, oh that, come on! <laughs> oh, that scene with Tex. Yes. yes. <laughs> oh yeah, I, I should be able to find that one easily, and I'll I'll put it on the Discord. Okay. Not the best time when we still got stuff. <clears throat> Are you okay, Sonic? <laughs> Piece of cake. Sonic, you were tops. Since you're my best pupil, I'll let you have a go at being leader when I step down. Not that I plan on calling it quits anytime soon, Copper. <laughs> Man, what with you know, what is with her? So, did you find any material? Right here, pal. Alright! More material. I knew it'd be a ripper idea to come here. That's so well and good, but... I'm curious as to what that robot was that attacked us. <laughs> oh, I can tell you that, mate. What? Really? There's gotta be some uh, secret organization that's out to get me, yeah? They're jealous of my famous adventures and they want to put a stop to them. The adventures that started like yesterday. All right, let's uh, let's keep going, shall we? But I won't give up. Never. You can't make me. No, you no good bunch of dingoes. My adventuring spirit will not be broken so easily. Yeah, uh, that's the spirit there, Marine. <laughs> yeah, Marine really is just cream if she was cooped up in her room for her entire life instead of being let out to actually do stuff. Yeah, no, I feel like even Sonic wanted to tell her to calm down. This is something. Yeah. If we had a sailboat, we could get a part of art there. The blueprints for um, the sailboat are finished. It, yep. There we go. If you want me to build the sailboat, just let me know. Is Sonic to uh, build a craft? <laughs> okay. Yep, because you it. Bless you. In order for me to build a sailboat, I'll need five green material and five bronze material. Okay, so already I'll need to redo a level. Okay. Yeah, you can see where this can be an annoyance with this game. Okay. Set sail. So, annoyingly... 
I think we actually have to, well, sail a bit to actually get back to the level. We don't, we can't, uh, uh, sorry, something we can't dance in this ship, what? Yeah, we actually have to sail a bit before we can uh, go back there. So, yeah, what? at least I'll make the... <laughs> Hopefully this will work. Okay. So yeah, we'll have to see how that go all goes. Okay. Repair. There. Okay, that does seem like it's going to work. So yeah, just make a quick U-turn. Yeah, island, land. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's. <laughs> it. Let's do it. Yeah. Okay. We should be. Yeah. We sh yeah. Hopefully, we can just leave after the first act and we don't have to do all th three levels at once again. Alright. But, uh, yeah, you can definitely... I uh, wait too long there. This can become a nuisance over time if we need more materials than we have and such. Mm. At least this does give us an opportunity to find better parts here, even if I'm missing pretty much all of them. Okay. Hmm. But yeah. Uh, I think I think I'm out of things to really react on at the moment. Oop, I missed that again. The exact same freaking spot. Get there, Captain. Get there. Okay. Yo, at least on the level you can blow up steam. <laughs> There we go. Yes, no, people, I can hit puns too. <laughs> it's more that this, yeah, the steam will be blown at us. <laughs> Here. Well, that's good for your skin, ain't it? From what I hear, but too much, yeah, too much is always uh, not too good. Yeah. <laughs> this is probably just... way too much. Yeah, just don't get blasted by a. Extremely hot steam uh, for again. Uh, yeah, and will, that again. It can, depending how hot it is, it can hurt you badly, including yeah. probably even permanent scars. And people have been killed by steam from uh, like steam trains and such. Yeah. Okay. Hmm? I can Ooh. burn. Yeah. Uh, okay. Well, I did not know when people die from the beams to the trains. I don't know how many people talk about the pipe accidents. Yeah, that's what I thought too. Yeah, I'm not too Steve. sure on it, but it is, of course, a possibility. Ooh. Nice to get through this time. Uh, Okay, that's all for rings gone. <clears throat> yeah, typically I believe the steam trains only really unload or depressurize when there aren't people nearby or such. But I could be entirely wrong about that being hot enough to actually still be uh, dangerous and such. It, it might be true, I guess, for... Haven't I ever seen anyone be too close it when it vents? They usually a bit like I see them. I see people get from the up from this uh, venting, but they're not next to the pipe. They usually are a bit some uh, meters away. Yeah. Like when on the train stations uh, area. Then. Okay. 
Yeah, there doesn't seem to be a way to get out once we are in a level, so that's also a, a bit of a complaint. But uh, well, at least we'll have more than enough material from this. Wait, you mean you need, you need to do the boss again? I'm not sure on that, we'll have to see. Hmm. I, I don't, I wouldn't mind too much, but... If we'd have to do all three stages in a row again... Yeah. That could become a, a nuisance over time, of course. Yeah! <laughs> Okay. Let's do it. Hmm. I could just die to this thing, but we have ten lives, so uh, that would take a bit of time. So instead, we'll just uh, hit the monkey with its own nuts. What? That sounds physically impossible. <laughs> well, that's what we're doing here. Or with its own balls. <laughs> There. Yep. Have you, you said squirrel? That it would make more sense? But... <laughs> a monkey? But the face of that thing does look like a monkey to me at least. Uh, kinda? Looks more like a helmet. Okay, that was a bit of a <laughs> rock and a hard place moment. Okay. Oh, did not mean to hit the. <laughs> I'll take it. Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there is some calculation with this impact on these. Like, if we're. <laughs> if we're moving, then it gets. Launched higher. What are you saying wrong? <laughs> Sorry, it's just that I'm not really interested in Sonic, and I've been currently playing. I'm I'm half in your stream and half playing Ghost Recon Future Soldier. <laughs> okay. okay. <laughs> yeah, go and focus I'm... on that if you want. That's fine. It's just that. I got really annoyed because there's a dude behind a booth, and I and my brain thought like the booth was like it had bulletproof glass, so I couldn't shoot the guy. And then, out of sheer instinct, I decided to shoot the guy, and it isn't bulletproof. Okay. <laughs> I'm trying to break the Russian president out of a gulag. Okay, certainly sounds like the story that has some twists and turns. Oh god, okay. the gulag is a fresh. No, not a goulash, that's a dish, gulag. Yeah, yeah, that, that was the dish I actually, my brain went to. Okay, so, so, so for the record, Rakia's mental image there was that Rom was trying to dig the Russian president out of a, a bowl of goulash. <laughs> Uh, one of, I was just imagining Rome trying to dig out of a bowl of goulash. I missed the president uh, part. Okay. So, like, Marine, help me out. That guy okay. ran into my grenade. That's that's more funny than anything else. Just I throw a grenade and the guy charges straight into it from his cover. Oh dear. And now we have a sailboat. Brother, it's a boat with sails, not an actual sailing sail. <laughs> it's all finished, Sonic. And I control aboard the sailboat, which again does not really have a sail. It has a protective sail on top of it, but not a typical sail. But it sails as fins. <laughs> all right, I've never been out this far before. My great adventure is finally beginning. Okay, let's put on a right. safe. I have something to share, something that happened yesterday before I went to watch some movies with my family. No. Uh, my thought aside. I was thinking, okay, we, we prepare some uh, uh, crackers, uh, crackers, you know, bread, uh, before uh, going away. 
So, for some reason, I decided to fix them in my room. So, I was to take the butter knife, grab some butter, and somehow I accidentally catapulted the butter, a big chunk of it, right on my damn phone. <laughs> so, were you going to make a call to butter someone up? Oh, good God! <laughs> uh, before people ask, yeah. yes, I did. I did clean my phone. I did. And I did not eat that butter. Since that butter blood mm. on the damn phone. No, I'm not gonna eat that. Since the fingers and everything else has been on that damn phone. So no. Yeah. All right. Finally, we uh, finally our sailboats. We did a bonzer job. Now let's get the sailing, mates. Now we can sail out to even further islands. <laughs> Thanks for the hard yakka there, crew. It, this, is a, it, this is a beaut here, it is. So where to next? I'm surprised those two haven't gone like, what the hell is she saying yet? Hmm. <laughs> Let me see. Huh? Who's that? Hey, Marine, how are you? Oh, if it, is, if it ain't the spy, good day, air cover. Long time no see. Spy. He's the coconut crew's um, intelli um, infiltrate. Yeah, this bloke here is the, the colonel. He calls himself a spy. <laughs> calls himself a spy. Good day. Nice to meet you. So, who are the lot of you then? <laughs> so, you and Marine built that boat then. Nice job. And an entire bloody dock for it as well. You can go a long way in that. Yeah, I still need to figure out where to go. Wait, Colonel, you know how uh, tons of stuff, mate. Well, yeah, I've, I've got plenty of intel. It doesn't come cheap, though, I warn you. What? All right, tell us, mates, please. Aren't we, like, the best buddies and all that? Okay, okay, just calm down. I'll tell you. Hold your horses. All right. Well, I saw a long stretch of shallows on the western side of the Machine Island. Don't shallows? I swear to God, because I gotta try it again. Okay. <laughs> Angry muttering. Nah, it's just that I gave the Russian president an SMG for some reason, and I'm trying to get to the extraction point. <laughs> and you're getting to regret that because they're going after every target they see? Yeah, just I'm just muttering to myself, you better not shoot anybody. Or you. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> which button does what? Well, my spy sense was all tingling, see? Then I followed my hunches. We've got to give it a gander. I'm just dying for a good walkabout. Come on. Well, we may as well check it out, right? Okay, Where let's go. Ah, uh, the AI had... <laughs> Yeah, I had found in Future Soldier. So, these people basically ha go out of their way to kidnap the Russian president, and while the Ru and everything is on fire, and the Russian president just sort of walks, walks on by in front of them. Oh dear. On the upside, he didn't shoot anybody. On the amusing side, they all died to an explosion, so I didn't have to shoot them. On the even okay. funnier side, that's actually because of how the AI is coded. Because they're just stupid? N now, the thing is, the AI is coded to go after the player. Not, like, they will take down the AI, but they're mainly aiming at you. Okay. Okay, so we can make some decorations with uh, rings and such. Probably not re too much of a gameplay effect, but oh well. Uh, anything around here that we can see? It? <laughs> this tail's built an entire internal dock. Wait, okay. it's one of those wheel ships. <laughs> okay, control the ship with the stylus. When the stylus is ready, touch, okay. I'll steer the actual ship, Sonic, so you can just focus on taking out the enemies. By touching the touchscreen, you can fire the guns at that spot. Use the guns to take out these enemies. 
Okay. So we have different weapons. And yeah, basically... We do the least amount during, or we do the, we don't do any actual sailing. Okay, the guns fire in rapid uh, fire quickly, so they're good for taking out fast enemies or for shooting down attacks. Large enemies will deflect any damage from the guns, though. Use the cannon on enemies like this. Okay, cannon is very powerful, but can't fire very rapidly. The can't fire will reload, and so be careful. Okay. Aim to the right of the enemy to score a better, uh, to better score a hit. Yeah, leading the attack and such. Okay, where are they? Up. Okay. Yeah. Just keep on going. I remember that these can be pretty hectic, though, because, well, we're basically in a light gun section. What? A light gun section. No, he heard no, you. He's just confused. What? Dude, are you so what the... <laughs> Taze is offering us now? Yeah, a flamethrower. No worry, I won't eat it. It's, it's too big anyways. You can attack by sliding the stylus around. The guns and cannon you let you collect rings, but the flamethrower makes it easier. However, the reload time is even longer than that of a cannon, so use it wisely. Slide the stylus around and collect as many rings as you can. Oh, did, did they seriously go to history books to the supposedly ancient weapon of great fire that was used to burn ships? Maybe. Okay, that works best. Uh, people were wondering. There has been art for such ancient origin that depicts a boat, only a dragon ship flamethrower. They went close to other ships just to burn them. <laughs> okay, use all three weapon types to take out a bunch of enemies. Oh, and for people who don't know what Greek fire is, it's, it's basically. The people think it may be napalm, probably is you can't. If you pour water on it, it just spreads more. This is gonna why you don't want it into building your ship. Okay. okay, this might actually be easier on the <laughs> like this. Because I, I can't... mean if it's a light gun thing, it usually tends to be easier with a mouse and keyboard. True, but this is this is originally supposed to be with the stylus and such. Okay, um, now for the actual. <clears throat> okay, set sail. Not for One Piece, but to uh, <laughs> the west. Okay. There. And uh, yeah, we have a lot farther than we can that we can go with this. Am I the only one who gets this more and more concerned about Tails by each game? <laughs> yes. Like, he's becoming more and more a mad scientist with the stuff he makes. Yeah. Hang on! I'm trying to play for her! <laughs> okay. Here we go with the ocean yeah. tornado. I don't know. I think my... The earliest view of these were not of him making weapons. Okay, Mr. I, President, have you ever heard of the Fulton Recovery system? The Fulton Recovery System. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that can well for them. Oh dear. Yeah. What, what game are you playing in Rome? Ghost Recon Future Soldier. Okay. I think yeah, that could be if uh, people would. People watching this stream may need that uh, context. <laughs> yeah. We can't go any further. Well, what should we do? Change course? Yeah, certain ships won't be able to pass through certain areas, like these shallows here. So we'll have to go around. There we go. That should still be close enough, I think. Here we go. Hmm. 
At later stage, I might be. At later stage, I might be able to use that to cheese things a bit. Okay. It's a point of them. Oh, and you're. Oh, and Moscow's on fire. Okay. That's in the game. I don't know about real life. Yeah. Okay. Come on. It. Uh, wait, what? Okay, what's. Hmm? Okay, that's. That was way too early. There's still a good chunk to go still. Or are we running into something else here? Sonic, there's something moving over there. There's a water bike coming this way at like incredible speed. Sonic Marine, watch out! Hey, you must be the blue hedgehog that everyone's talking about lately. You may be fast, but you're not as fast as me. Let's see what you got. Where are you? I'm the Sultan of Speed, the unparalleled and unequaled Johnny. No one can keep up with me. No one. <laughs> you really want to go up against me in a test of speed? What's the matter? Are you scared? Sounds interesting. You're on. Hold it. If you're looking for a test of speed, you gotta get through me here uh, first. I'm Captain Marine, the speed <laughs> milk drinking champion of Windmill Village. Not that kind of speed, Marine. No time to waste on humoring you, kid. Come on, Hedgehog, let's do this. You're just scared I'll beat you, you mug. I don't I blame you, though, really. <laughs> Wouldn't want to lose to a Sheila like me after all that melt and jabber. <laughs> and Marine. I'm not going to sit here and listen to this, not even from a kid. Alright, I'll take you on first, then. <laughs> That's the spirit. Have a fair go, then. <laughs> Quick, so how it's done, Sonic. Don't be a bludger now. But I thought you, huh? Marine. Oh, brother. Okay, and yeah, to get the chaos symbols, we have to we have to raise this guy. Wait, John, me and the no, no, please don't, don't tell me he's. Style is based on Yoni Bravo. Uh, I doubt that, but it's definitely supposed to be a Pompadour. Of that, I'm pretty sure. All oh, right, that's what we call it. <laughs> uh, yeah, to get the Emerald, we just need to, well, get to it first. Or we'll beat him in the ring at least. Uh, to beat him to the ring. Uh, yeah, to the end at least. Uh, Apparently his dumbass is getting stuck on the mines. Okay. But yeah, we can hurt him with the boost. So we should probably save up some of that for if he manages to get past it. Because I'm pretty sure his base speed is faster than ours. And I remember that some of these can be really tough. Yep. One out of seven. A bit overly fancy area, maybe, but it still looks pretty. Let's do it. Okay, continuing the rest. If I remember correctly, we don't, we won't run into Johnny randomly. We need to actually go find him on some uh, hidden islands. Okay. So yeah, it's not like random encounters. Uh, so this is, I think this ship is a hybrid of many different kind of ships. New islands. Land, of course. We're not going to go back. Okay, right into it. Wait, hidden? Nope. 
Alright, there are... Now remember, there are some levels here that are just mini-levels, as you can find all around the place. Ow. Ooh. It's a big one. What the heck? Okay, but yeah, just hidden islands where you can just do a quick little level for some stuff, I believe. Okay, and that gets us. A. Some blue and iron material. Okay, so I was wrong about getting three on an A. Hmm. What in the world is this? It looks like some kind of old altar. Uh, see yeah. you. Thank you. Hey, look, I think it can be budged. Marine, you probably shouldn't touch it. But I want to see what it does. Don't touch it, and we're all gonna die. You just angered the god of the island. That's <laughs> quick. Hey, you two, look at that. <laughs> New Island. Crikey, something's coming out of the water. What is that thing? I don't believe it. It's an island. Do my eyes deceive me? Or are we looking at a new challenge, Marine? <laughs> Come on, you blokes. Well, I suppose we might as well check it out. Come on, you like You want to live forever? <laughs> <laughs> uh, more like you hedgehog and, <laughs> and fox. <laughs> Though of all three, the one most likely to get themselves killed is Marine. <laughs> it's not like we've got anywhere else to go. Alright, mateys, prepare for landing. This place is a beaut. I didn't think that on the water cave... Yeah, I didn't think that on the water caves like this even existed. It's like something out of a storybook. This is the best adventure ever. Okay, mates, stay close. I'll lead the way. Marine, it could be dangerous. Or this could be dangerous. Oi, I'm the captain. That means I get the lead. Okay, fine. But stay behind me. After all, the captain dangerous. needs bodyguards, right? It could be dangerous. Yeah, that's why it's so fun. <laughs> it's also why you're going first. Yeah, you say you drop in first? Maybe. <laughs> He currently is the one with a gun. <laughs> yeah, but I want to lead from the front. Okay, Marine. It could be really dangerous in here. Hey, Sonic. This is a bot, not okay. <laughs> hey, Sonic, look at all these footprints. Hmm. They lead inside. Marine, be careful. It looks like somebody else may already be inside somewhere. What? You're right. I won't let those buggers get away that easily. And she runs off again. Hey, Marine, wait. And she never knows when to quit. Okay. Let's do it. Wait, <laughs> this. Hmm? Yes. Good. Well, mo I forgot a little Disney mermaid vibe. That is was suddenly gone. <laughs> okay, you, you, you were know. fearing that uh, a crab was going to start uh, singing about living under the sea. Yeah, I was afraid there would be a parody of that. Mm. Uh, I think you also <laughs> killed a uh, uh, crab. Yeah, multiple. <laughs> Are they robotic crabs? Yeah, probably. <laughs> so yeah, no crap meat for you. <laughs> there we go. Yeah. 
Apple pads? Yep. <laughs> the bats say hell no to that. Nope. Okay. Oop. Ah, good. Yeah, definitely robot crab. Okay, we need to break those free when we find them. Okay. Yeah, this game uh, likes to play a lot more with the 3D, eh? Yeah? It's like a hybrid. Okay. Yeah, 2.5D and all that. It, it, so that one broke on its own. <laughs> it's like we weren't on our knees. Maybe that. Okay. Good. Good. Come on. Yep. And back down. Let's try that again. Okay. Good. Good. Need a better angle. There, there. And go. Okay. At least the levels aren't as long, so it is a easier to redo them if we get, well, not enough material. Okay. As long as we can get six per region, we should generally get enough. Hopefully for new material, for new, uh, <clears throat> for new, yeah, ships, there. Yeah. Why was I blanking on that for a moment? Because the human brain tends to fuck with you. Yeah. yeah very likely. It's not the Ooh. first time. Any happens all, to all of us. Yep. Really? Okay, that was, <laughs> I'm pretty sure I hit that thing just before it was going to attack, but I will. There, there, okay. Now I can do the anglerfish. There's probably some way that you can prepare that to make it more appetizing than it looks. Yeah, I, I know there's a anglerfish like it, one that's kind of flat. I don't know its English name, I know its Swedish name, uh, Mar Ulk. Mm. Well, I think I've seen uh, people, people selling those on the market, so they look hideous. Mm. Would anybody be willing to troll around in Gold Creek on Breakpoint? Uh, yeah, I've got it. Uh, from what I've heard and seen myself, it isn't as good as Wildlands. Oop, failed that jump. Or, I heard that with one patch they added a new mode that is basically like Wildlands. If I remember correctly, a patch did add in the ability to just disable stuff like gear level, so... Okay. Guns, so guns aren't like... That's annoying to use, like, oh, this gun is now slightly better than the exact same gun I'm holding, just because of some numbers. Yeah, I, I think that, uh, I think they tried to put in microtransactions with that stuff as well. I don't remember that, but then again, I didn't play it, so I wouldn't, and, oh, okay, it's 3D. Yeah. <laughs> it was a game over for a second. Same. <laughs> Okay, we can lean to steer this thing. We can jump. But, yeah. I think it was called immersive mode, but you can just fuck around with, like, the difficulty. Really? Really, I'd be willing to play. Really, I'd be willing to play, but I would also like to play with, like, the gear level off. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> We could, uh... Okay, come on. Yes. <laughs> I'm just getting punished for not holding right down. <laughs> Press down. Okay, at least we have more than plenty levels. Better, Captain. Better. Okay. But, yeah, would you... Uh, would you prefer going for story with that or just screwing around in it? 
Can we do both? That's more or less what we do with Borderlands. True. Messi <laughs> really is all of the Borderlands experience. Yeah, that yeah, is we, uh, we, could, we could definitely do that in Borderlands as well, which I would consider the better game between them, since I basically gave up on Breakpoint after like an hour. In part because it ran like absolute shit, I believe. Huh. But yeah, we can add it to the shenaniganery lists. Hang on, I gotta check something. Hey. Did you like refund it or do you still have it? I still have it. I've rarely refunded games, though with some I probably should have. Really, really, really that close to the end. Yep. Oh, I'm, I'm so getting a C for this. Okay, color you're me gonna... surprised. You, you got an A. What the heck? <laughs> Congrats, you got an A, even though you, <laughs> though none of us thought you'd get one. Sear me timbers, it beat a jeweled scepter. Looks like we'll be shipping out sooner than they... Uh, they... Good going, boss. You're amazing, boss. Har har har. I've asked. Hurry up and grab that scepter, mateys. Aye aye, sir. Ah, here we go. Huh? Who's that? Arr? Who might you be, you scalawags? We should be asking you the same thing, old man. We'd best be staying away lest you fancy winding up in Davy Jones's locker. See, old man, you've got me all curious. What's your bizzo down here, anyway? <laughs> What's that look on him? He's just... He's sweat Anyhow! Yeah, anyhow. <laughs> yeah, yeah, <man. laughs> there are your OB hard swaggling old Captain Whisker here. That there yeah, hedgehog please, has been pilfering uh, around making trouble for me and my mateys. Go ahead. Mind if I try it? That there hedgehog has been pilfering around making trouble for me and my mateys. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sonic, do you think these are the guys who sent that robot after us? I think there's a pretty good chance of that. Don't look so happy about it. <laughs> Oi, old man, that's a pretty nifty mustache you have there. Yoink! <laughs> Blimey! Let go of that, you filthy blind rat! <laughs> Builds. <laughs> and she gets sent flying. Ah. Oh, boy, heck, that's there! <laughs> ah! And she's fine. Marine, are you okay? That? That was Ripper. Do it again. Come on again. Curse ye land lovers. No one is allowed to set hand on me precious whiskers. <laughs> I'll make ye roll today. I swear, he. I swear, when he has his mouth open like that, he kind of looks like a hand puppet. <laughs> And there's uh, Blaze. Yeah, Blaze. Blaze <laughs> Sonic? Weren't you, the, weren't you in the bad timeline? No, this is the Blaze from a different dimension. <laughs> also, yeah, no, look at the look at the robot, Captain. He does, he looks like a hand puppet. With his yeah. mouth <laughs> but he's a robot, so... so... Technically, he's like a mechanical hand puppet. <laughs> what are you doing here? Didn't you go back to your own universe? No, wait, what are you doing here? Do you still want to do it? I think Rob is, Rob is distracted. I was calling him Rob. Avast <laughs> ye, we still got a score to settle, mateys. Ah, ghost cracking. Seize them. Seize them. <laughs> we'll talk later. You good to go, Sonic? Hey, remember who you're talking to. <laughs> okay. Next boss. Yeah, I'm tired. I think I'll... I, well, I hate, so I kind of want to sleep right now. Sorry. I'll see you later. See you later. No worries. Yeah. Thanks thank for being here. Thank, thank you for your name. See you guys too. Later. Later.
Okay, it's going to pop out its tentacles, and one of them is going to have a weak spot. Ooh. Oh, it's getting picked off. Ooh. Okay, it's blocked us in. Okay, coming down with that. There we go. Okay, probably better if I just put it in this one. We've seen what we've seen the moves now. Okay, with that one, it spits out probably to try and stun. Yep, missed that one. Yep, ooh. Okay, it'll pop them back out again. Yep, yep. <laughs> Stop that! Okay. Ooh, here we go again. I, I, I do have to say that I really like these... Uh, where I do like games where or on the DS where they use both screens in combats like this. I would never get very disorganized uh, quickly from that. Or disorganized. Okay, this should be. Mm. Oh. Okay. And okay. Final hits. Yep. yep. Really. Um <laughs> Still got it. Plenty of experience with Mario Kart of oh, getting my <laughs> bloopers. Uh, gives me plenty of experience to, well, <laughs> learn how to get around that. <laughs> okay, and that means we have seven red material, I believe. Ah, they, got, they always seem to get away right at the last second. Hey, where are you going? Those pirates have gotten their hands on a jeweled scepter. It's an ancient treasure from my homeland, and I've got to get it back right away. Let's see, so these guys are pirates. <laughs> the outfit didn't give it away, and the dog didn't give it away either, Tails. <laughs> That's where they kept messing with us. Hmm. So we're caught up in all of this too. Anyway, just why are you here, Bryce? Aren't you supposed to be back in your own world? I should be asking you the same thing. Why are you here, Sonic? Huh? Wait, you don't suppose? Are we the ones who have been sucked into Blaze's world? Yep, welcome to the Soul Dimension. Oi, hold I this. Asked... <laughs> Go ahead. I, was, I asked about this in the in the last stream. <laughs> and you got your answer. Oi, hold it. Will someone please tell me what's going on here? I see. So we we're caught up in the storm, and when you woke up you were here. And then I found a rescue lot. When I ended up in Sonic's world, it was because our worlds needed to be saved. And I had been led there by the Soul Emeralds. So if we're in your world, Blaze, then it must mean... Yes, I fear that something must be amiss again. Hails. Right, we've got to get to the bottom of this, Sonic. Blaze, this might not, uh, this might not just be a problem for your world. So we should help you out. Two rats are better than one, and three are better than two. Fine, do as you like. All right, that settles it. <laughs> Yay, thanks, Blaze. No worries, no worries, just leave it all to me. Sonic, by the way... Yeah? Who's this little girl? <laughs> little girl? <laughs> You're gonna treat me like any old Sheila then, are you? Sonic, Tails, don't let her yabber about your captain like that. Get her. Captain? <laughs> it's a long story. <laughs> oh dear. 
cocktails. Can you build a device you know, to scan for or yeah, to scan for and analyze plasma and extra, yeah, electromagnetical signals? Hmm? Well, I mean, sure, but that's gonna end up coming out of nowhere, Blaze. Yes, I realize that. Plasma electric. Uh, what now? What are you talking about, mate? And whatever all that means, when we're done with all that, can we go back to the fun? You think that electromagnetical samples uh, signals might uh, give us some clues, please? Fully ignored. <laughs> That's my hope at any rate. There's got to be something at the source of that transmission, for starters. I see. So if we had some kind of detector, we'd be able to get to the bottom of things. With materials we've collected, I should be able to whip up just to such device. Thanks, I don't mean to trouble you. If the pirates were in that part of the ocean, then that might mean... Might, yeah, then that might mean... Okay, I'll get started on some blueprints for a radio tower then. A radio tower? Here we get to listen to music and climb all around on it, mate. Uh, not exactly. Okay, and yeah, now Blaze is here. First, we need the materials to build a radio tower. Um, yeah. Switcheroo! <laughs> Let's hurry up and find them. Do we have the stuff we need? Let's see. Five green material, five bronze, and a thousand rings. Okay, we've got the rings, we've got the bronze. Okay. That means that the red material is likely for the next boat. I, I don't know what, what is a ship? I actually heard a phrase on a speeder before. I just didn't expect a Sheila to be a... animal? Sheila is just an Australian word for girl or woman. Oh. <laughs> You're from another world? I don't, get qu uh, I don't quite get what that means, but it sounds keen. Wait. Okay, now I'm more curious. What the heck is Marine? Yes, he's a raccoon. Oh, she, she, she is a raccoon, alright. Yep. And here I was pondering if it was Wait. like a red panda or an, a, a tanuki. Oh, well, it seems I was completely wrong. We can just go straight to the place. And we can play as Blaze. <laughs> Captain very happy. Yep. You can't get me. Defense, he still has that line. Oh dear. Uh, oh. Wait, uh, I think you need to do this, this scene change again. Yep. Wait. There we go. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I, I have this I have this stream back to my left, so I kind of maybe I should move it to my right or something because my right hand tends to be more open or unused during these uh, DS uh, emulated streams. Yep, you, you do have me lucky enough. Yeah, to keep an eye on that. So yeah, I, I hope I'm not annoying you. We're gonna uh, remind you. Uh, nah. Okay. And yeah, Blaze's bag of tricks is basically the same as before. She is slower, but she has a lot more, well, reins with uh, these moves and such. As you can see, she can fly about like half the screen's distance. I guess you could say, Sonic is speed, while Blaze is fem. Mm -hmm. Does that make sense? Yeah, offense, yeah. <clears throat> I guess you see Sonic is speed and Blaze is combat. Yeah. Okay. And uh, hmm, this might be a somewhat controversial thing to say, but Blaze is one of the few characters who is fully Sonic's equal in power and such. But it would make sense since she kinda has his role-ish. In her universe, so it would make sense? Yeah. Like, Shadow is also just uh, equal power with him, but he's fully a, a rival, whereas both Blaze is full and friendly. Yeah. Hmm. That also reminds me... 
I want someone to do AVW no. reaction documentary about oh, sort of a, more of a reaction to some old Zelda cartoon oh, but Adventure oh. Link, I think it was called. It. I think I know what you're talking about, like the 90s and such? Yeah. It's a Excuse was me, princess, that one? Yeah, we did not hear the, the, them speak at all in that video like enough. But yeah, apparently not many people knew it because when they released the VSH of the Super Mario show, they cut that uh, show out. The this was apparently supposed to be aired along with Super Mario. Yeah, it was. The uh, Super Mario show was supposed to be, uh, what is the word for it exactly? Like, uh, where it's basically just, uh, hmm. and they, they run a bunch of other shows through it as well. I forget what the specific term for that is, and I completely missed that. <laughs> there has been a, a few shows, but it has been a little bit past. You say, one action in a horror movie is not even. Mm -hmm. was, there we uh, go. That one was also had been a. Not the movie, but they changed it. Okay. Yep. But, yeah, the reason I bring it up is. Uh, he said something that I, that I plan to investigate. Who? Oh. They mentioned. <laughs> A Metroid cartoon. Uh, there, there was a there was a show with Metroid character, or at least one Metroid character, uh, Captain N, the something something game yeah, master. That, yeah, that's what I, I recall. I have seen a bit of. What the weird show? <laughs> Even as a kid, I thought that show was weird. Okay. Let's toast this oversized gecko. Boy. <laughs> Here we go with this one. But yeah, I don't remember there being an actual Metroid show at any point. Yeah, hmm. but I think we can agree. There has to be many old shows that are older than us. Yeah. And there's also and a lot so of lost media. Yeah, and there's also been shows that uh, I wouldn't know of because they were reruns. Which reminds me, some of the only old cartoons. I actually watched the, the, the newest Dungeons & Dragons movie. Yeah, and? I've heard a lot of good about it. it. I liked it. Wait, wait, have you seen it yourself? No, I've seen snippets of it. Like, uh, oh. the fat dragon. Yeah, uh, okay. Okay, uh, okay, now, uh, now I want to ask you, have you seen the old, old Dungeons and Dragons cartoon? This I've series? never seen any full episodes myself, I think, but I have seen uh, bits here and there. Yeah, okay, this is probably the only spoiler we give you. It's the characters from the old cartoon, the characters from the old show appears in the movie. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> so, I spotted them right away. I just hit my head. Uh, just went. Wait, what? Like, I did not expect them to appear there at all. I'm not gonna say tell you when it appeared, but it did catch me off guard. <laughs> okay, but that kind of means that uh, they never actually escaped back to their own world. <laughs> because I, I think that show never actually got a, an actual ending. I'm Ow. sure. I, I never. I know I started watching it on YouTube, but then I lost track and needed a break from it. Because whoever put it on YouTube did not organize the last episode properly. So, yeah. Okay. Well, yeah. I'll probably buy that on disc uh, if I find it. Yeah. No, I will say this. I don't know if that it's the it, it, with them being there is can. Or Use an Easter egg. Yeah, from what I've heard, there's a lot of Easter eggs in that game. Not that game show. That show. The movie. There, there, Captain. There, there. Take okay. the crafts. Eat a mushroom. Start just building. Evil. Okay. 
then now we've got a weather vane. <laughs> it's all been it's Sonic. Video tower is not complete. Hey, listen up, everybody. Hmm? What's up? You know how we made a tower to detect plasma and electric and magnetic waves? We just did that. Yeah, okay, that tower. I love the tower. It's perfect for climbing, and the view from the top is a beaut. Uh, remind us to put uh, barbed wire around that thing to keep her off it. So what about the tower? Well, I've detected some strange electromagnetic activity. Electromagnetic activity? What's electromagnetic mean? It's really weird. It's a waveform I've never seen before. I never even seen it. Fails. This is Blaze's world, remember? Things might be pretty different here. That's true, I guess. Wait. The electromagnetic activity. It's very unusual. Hey, do you know something about this? Yes, we have picked up unusual readings before, but... The source is still unknown. And we only have a rough idea of its location. It's near an area known for sightings of ghost ships. Really? Sounds like fun. Maybe we can find something there. Like new materials. You are getting obsessed with these materials, Tails. Hmm. I was intending to take a closer look at that air area, so this is perfect. So which direction is the electromagnetic activity coming from? It's coming from the east. So it's that really foggy area, huh? What's wrong, Marine? You seem awfully quiet. Huh? What is it? It looked like you were lost in thought or something. Come on, where's all that energy you usually have? Let's get going. Uh, yeah, let's go. Hmm? It's true. Are we really going? There's going to be ghost ships. I can't be scared, though. I'm the captain. No ghost can scare me off. <laughs> oh, dear. Actually, can I... Is anything new to say? That radio tower that Tails has made is quite impressive indeed. Captain? Yeah, I know, but these aren't really as important as... Uh, what do you mean? Mm. I just figured it's easier for people to read as well if you do this. Yeah. This can make anything, can't he? I bet, I bet you could learn a lot from me, Sonic. Well, so they've known each other for what? Uh... Actually, 2000, this game came out in 2007, two years after Rush in 2005. And yeah, Sonic, the first Sonic game was released in 91. I don't exactly remember when Sonic 2 came out, but that was when, so when Tails uh, joined. So yeah, they've known each other for a decade, right by the time this game released. Okay, hello. Sonic, please tell Princess Blaze that I have found where one of our Soul Emeralds is. Please undertake the mission and retrieve the Soul Emerald for our kingdom. Speak to the Marine to start the mission and hope that the uh, and hope that the princess does her best. Wait, what? Yep, we is get this missions. A hmm? Is this a retcon or a mistake? Uh, yeah, Sonic and Tails don't actually know that Blaze is a princess yet. Yeah. No, more of, this is what I know. It's not a kingdom. Hmm. It's an empire. Uh, okay. So yeah. Let's set sail. Okay, we can start from anywhere. So, back from South Island, avoid the shallows. And here. Okay. Well, yeah, I guess that means we're going to have to, well, find the Soul Emeralds as well through missions. I believe the Chaos Emeralds we all get from, uh, just praising Johnny. Hello? <laughs> okay, I'm getting better at timing those. Yep, about to be transitioning between. Uh, this looks like a hybrid between a wheelboat... A Greek ship, 
a Galleon, a Yuck. And we went all in on, on trying to make a unique design for this. At least with that, yeah. Ooh. Yeah, we can actually damage those. Okay, and these reload almost instantly. Okay, now we've got bombers to deal with. Or we would have if we weren't done already. Okay. I remember one little nuisance, and we got to see that earlier. Is during the last bit when the camera turns, enemies can still attack. So if you are oh. very low on health, you might get sunk at the very, very end. Oh. Hey. No six. Yeah. Uh, no six. Don't worry. I have just the thing. Now it's get just your news with a cactus. No. Hmm. Huh? Yeah? What do you want? Hmm? Oh, it's Keylock. Marine? Is that really you? Seems like everyone managed to get off that damn island except for Marine, huh? Or more likely, they left her behind. <laughs> you know this guy, Marine? Yeah, sure, I yeah, d sure do. It's been Young's mate. <laughs> You're as scrappy as ever, you little runt. Right, I've lived here a long time, so I've heard rumors of that ghost ship, but... Let's hold up, Keylock. Or Kylock, whatever. If you know something, then fire away, mate. Marine, are you sure? You always were a bit scared of ghosts, after all. Ah, ah! <laughs> What's the matter? Why are you so in such a panic all of a sudden? <laughs> Come on, mate, don't bring that up. If you know what near the ghost ship is at, tell me. Well, it's just east of here. That's where they say the ghost ship appears. It's still just a rumor, though, mate. Uh, so don't think on it too hard, yeah? It is from here, yeah? Thank you. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's go raid that ghost ship, then. Hmm. Marine, are you sure you'll be okay? Well, it always was her dream to go out and see the world. I am a tad bit worried. I think I'll swing back by home for a while. How are all these koalas getting around? I'm gonna guess she's the only one who's not been able to leave the island on adventures. Yeah. Oh, so we have someone here now. I brought along a record of your adventures. Uh, we can we can watch the movies here, or the cutscenes. Okay. Huh? I, I, I do I like, like that. Yeah, I, we, I like that when uh, certain NPCs will do stuff like that. Of course, it, it would be easier to have a menu for that, but just having little hub areas like this, where you can just easily find them, it works just as well if you, for me. Hmm. Hey, Sonic, if you're up for a challenge, uh, if you can clear the mission, I will bring you a dinosaur I defeated on my journey. Talk to Marine if you want to give it a go. Good luck, mate. Yeah, we we can talk to Marine to go uh, to try and on any of these uh, missions and such. Just go take a look quickly. Play a mission. Please select a mission. Defeat the boss again. Get all soul emeralds. The ghost pendulum has powered up and is out of control. Defeat it again. Ghost Rex has powered up and is out of control. Defeat it again. Okay, I'll probably do some of these, but as you can see, uh, there's a lot. Holy! <laughs> so yeah, you could definitely, you definitely can't say that this game is starved for content. We guards have been ordered to seek out the Soul Emeralds, our world's greatest treasures. Okay. Wait, he's a god? Yep. Oh, but it was a mainland! <laughs> okay, oh, yeah. Or you know, something! Uh. 
Okay, here we go again. I do like the little cutscenes. They definitely put in work with this game. Oh, yeah. And we have the overclock on, but I am pretty sure that I remember far less slowdown with this game. So they definitely dial, they definitely managed to uh, refine things. Yep, yep we can just play now blow <laughs> islands. Or technically, what would you call those little uh, bits of land? They don't fully count Deep for. Rocks. Uh, they're a bit big for rocks. Too small for islands. I think that there is a more official term, but I think most people just call them sea rocks. Oh, uh, yeah. Go to. Easy to remember. And there yep. are. Torpedo. It's very easy to just uh, say that to warn that. Okay, I need to watch out so I don't uh, crash into it. That we could even destroy those for extra things, <laughs> okay? <laughs> oh dear. It's a private lives for hell. <laughs> okay, let's land. Hmm. Well, isn't this place charming? Where are we, Blaze? There are many stories of ships mysteriously disappearing in these waves. It does feel kind of weird. I've never put stock in the rumors, but being here, I can't deny this place is odd. <laughs> wow, it's like a, a graveyard. Maureen, are you okay? You don't look so good. No, I'm fine. I just, you know, figured out a... Maybe you guys might want to crack at things? Sometimes the captain just needs a break, I. Eh? Why me? The door's moving! <laughs> Marine, it's okay. It's only the wind. <laughs> scared? No, of course not. It's not like I'm scared of a ghost or anything. Besides, even if there are any ghosts, I'll just beat him up. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Not buying it. <laughs> Are you alright? Yeah, sure. Okay, let's keep going then. Try not to worry, Marine. Well, thanks to my top-notch performance, nobody realizes that I'm really scared. <laughs> I've gotta be careful here. I've got my captain's dignity to maintain after all. What dignity? <laughs> Come on, Marine, we're going. Hey, oi! Wait for me! <laughs> and yeah, now we can choose who we want to play as, so let's go play as Blaze a bit more. You can't escape me. Okay. Let's see, I'm trying to see if I can remember... Oh, right, that's... <laughs> that's one of the gimmicks here. He's... Uh... Uh, get out! <laughs> okay. Jump ropes and uh, capture barrels. There. Also, I, I just... Had an idea for yeah, a parody the... game. No. Get off you. Donkey Island. <laughs> it, it would be either a parody game or a rip off. <laughs> Up we go. Well, so far it was moody, so far I mean, went to just into the title. <laughs> oh well, you gotta start from somewhere. Yeah, again. Just a youthful concept. Back this way. Yeah, they haven't said the concept, but again. 
If it'd been Party of Monkey Island, it would have been rather uh, apparent. <laughs> okay, I thought you were going more for uh, Donkey Kong Island. <laughs> No, I actually mean donkey, like the animal, instead of monkey. Okay. You, you, you do realize donkey and monkey rhyme, correct? Yeah. Okay, okay go, go. I got distracted by the gunship in the background. Okay. But to this day, I don't understand why they call Donkey Kong Donkey Kong, and it's not a donkey. Yeah, it's supposed to be dumb monkey. I... <laughs> oh. Uh, that reminds me of... A video I'm pretty sure I have shown before, but I'll put it on the Discord anyways again. Uh, along with uh, the fight scene one, I'll have to remember to get that one as well. But uh, a fan animation that basically, well, apes uh, <laughs> the Donkey Kong Country uh, show style. For uh, just one specific, uh, uh, damn it, one specific joke <laughs> that goes oh. in, that, that it plays off of the whole thing that uh, every Kong, it, wrong button, every Kong is basically named after, well, a character trait slash what they are, like Cranky Kong being cranky and such. And anyone who knows the animation probably knows what I'm t talking about already. All right, the deep is a. There's a Diddy Kong, ain't it there? Yeah. I mm. just thought D Diddy was a name. <laughs> Until now you mentioned it, then I realized, all oh, right. I, I keep just instinctively trying to jump those cannonballs. I think most. I think I've seen a little bit of the show, but I mostly remember it thanks to what Takahata said about it. Yeah, they've been they've been ripping that lately quite a lot. Yeah, I think he said it something about that it was it's a surprisingly funny Canadian animation. <laughs> and yeah, I, I had always thought that yeah yeah I seen little bit of people commenting that. Uh, Yeah, certain uh, of the Kong's figure is quite, um... Voluptuous? Uh, I'm pretty sure it, right? the candy, uh, candy Kong has always been like that. Since her oh, very okay. first appearance. In... Where was her first appearance? I think Donkey Kong Country? Oh, I... I did not know she had, had, had appeared in the games. I only know Donkey Kong, uh, well, the original guy and his sidekick and a rhino. Uh, and of course the grandpa. Yeah, Cranky. Who is uh, actually the original Donkey Kong from the arcade game. I... Uh, all aware of this. <laughs> yep. This boy... Yeah, this is probably keeping away from Mario. Yeah, and Donkey Kong Jr. is the uh, current Donkey Kong's father. Oh dear. Silver material, okay. They look like discs or nightstands. <laughs> okay. One, two, three. Okay, that's definitely a quicker start with that. Oh, so I keep pressing X to boost when it's Y. It. Get rid of those. Yeah, it seems that those skulls will stick to us to try and slow us down, but we can't just boost them off. There, skip all of that. Hmm. Okay, we we get more height if we jump as we go up it, up with those. Let me out. Wash my glasses. Right back. Okay. We already super in the stream, really? Yep. Okay. 
Yeah, we dropped some rapids and fire rapid fire tricks. Uh, all right, there we go. Well, yeah, again with Blaze, we can just pull off some real big shortcuts. Right, wrong way. If we know them, of course. Yep, yep, get me out. I wouldn't be surprised if Donkey Kong set up those traps. Okay. The timing with these presses is pretty quick. Or a pretty small window, I should say. I, I, I brush my teeth, but I feel like I'm, uh, if I don't, I'm gonna be too tired to do it later, but I'm completely. Oh, okay. And that's Act uh, 2 uh, done a lot quicker. Holy... I will be nearby. I will... I will watch the steam steal just... I will watch it from a distance. Okay, so we do get three on... Okay, it must... It must level... Yeah, it must differ per... Uh, probably on the short left... Yeah, the side... The, the hidden places... Give us less because they're so much shorter. <laughs> Bro, check that out! <laughs> it's Whistler getting uh, getting his elbow cut off because he's too big for his own image. Whisker! Huh? Got to look with the mustache again, eh? Boss, look! Arr, that there hedgehog and his landlubber pals be uh, seeming familiar. Boss, your whiskers. They were the ones who pulled your whiskers. Blow me down, you're right. Me poor whiskers. They'll pay for what they did, are. Apparently he's been hitting the rum a bit hard if he's that short on memory. Curse you. Thanks to you, me precious whiskers be a uh, full quarter inch off center. Nar. All right, come on, old man. Don't be so mad. You can't even tell the difference, mate. You little livered lion lover. Mark my whiskers, will you? I'll have you swapping in the decks from here to kingdom come. Enough of this nonsense. Return the scepter to me immediately. Hmm? My, but you're persistent. If you want it that bad, try and take it. You think I can't? <laughs> Very smug, Blaze. Blaze, don't let him get you worked up. Dar, <laughs> this time I've got a secret weapon. Now you'll s I'll see you to David Jones for sure. There's some big words. You sure does not all talk? <laughs> you see for yourself. Oh, here he goes, pirates. Blow the man down. Yes, <laughs> here it comes. <laughs> okay, I do try to put on a bit of a tune. A bit of a tune for some of the... Tone for some of these. Uh, yeah, it's a big old ghost pirate thing. Oh my yeah. god. Now go... Yeah. And yeah, I remember this one being a nuisance because he'll detach from his safe from his yeah, weak point. No, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. what are you up to? Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. Can you? Okay, no rings left. Yep. And a life lost. Uh, yeah, this thing can be a nuisance. Yep. Okay. Did that send it up here again? Yep, it did. I just need to lure him away. Okay, they fused again. Just need to knock it out of him. Okay, that was lucky. Okay. Come on up here, you. Ow. 
in me. So, of those. Ah, damn it. Okay. If I recall correctly, this is my least favorite of the bosses. There. Knock it loose. Oop. Burn him down. But yeah, all of the bosses basically are just ghost something. Ooh, close. Not really. Okay, that, that's just unfair that he can just zoom in on me and damage like that. Okay. Uh, okay. Come on, how many times do I need to hit you again to knock your core out? There we go. Now where did it go? Okay, halfway. Oh, now it's annoyed. And now it started moving around as well. Well, the core started moving around. Okay. Yeah. Damn it. Immediately on that. Yeah, get out of that. Okay. Yeah, the, the fact that it can just zoom in on that for cheap hits is really annoying. Okay, both of us up here. Okay, core is loose. Well, it should send it down. Oh, apparently not. That was too fast for that. Okay. It's going for the stomp again. Okay. for that again yep, and gets me in the middle of the air <laughs> okay okay core is loose learn down but you're not going to get anything from attacking your own core dude come on are you guarding it yep, no uh, give me that. Okay. okay, now it's just... Now it's just randomly going around. Oop. Come on. Uh, com come on. Oh, really? Okay, so if we don't get the last hit in quickly enough, I'm presuming this will count for all the bosses, that so they'll just regain some of their health. Okay, like this one wasn't annoying enough already. Okay, 
Okay. Yep, managed to get a hit in on the <laughs> as he went up. Okay. Okay. Now where is it? Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. Also went to the dark room. Ah. Well, I have had my headphones on, I did watch a little bit uh, before going to the bathroom at least. Okay, this boss is just really freaking annoying. Especially since it's the weak spot just moves around at random for the last hits. Okay. We've got time for one more attempt, I'd say. Let's keep at this for now. Just launch the core, lure him down. Yep, did not mean to collect that. Okay. Halfway there. Hmm. Not really sure what the threat of that attack is. But maybe if we're standing still, we. We have a chance of getting launched or something. Coming up here, ugly. Okay, okay I'm keeping my eye like out. For... Hmm? What? I'm, I'm keeping my eye out for if it's doing the the zip, uh, where it just uh, clutters up and zooms over like that. I'm keeping an eye out for that. Okay. Right. Yeah. I also say is, I don't think music fits here. Yeah. The, the ball scene is for every, is the same for everyone except for maybe the last one. So, oh. like similar in the previous game. <laughs> I'm actually surprised same. I got an A. Okay, hopefully that means we don't have to do that level again. We have enough silver. <clears throat> All hands on deck, mateys. It's time for uh, if we be weighing anchor. Aye, aye, sir. Don't count uh, this here buccaneer out uh, just yet, hedgehog. Ha ha ha. Ah, he got away. If there's one thing he's good at, it's that. We must get the scepter back from him. I'm also concerned... Uh, with what these those pirates might have been trying to do here. I'm not sure. For now, let's get back to the ship on the ship and think up a plan. Yeah, yeah, let's get back on the ship and put our noggins together. Let's go, Blaze. Oh dear. <laughs> Blaze basically gets pushed around by Maureen. Uh, <clears throat> not again. I, I honestly wouldn't mind like getting the Aesis uh, Seeing the story of Sonic Rush and Rush Adventure in a more animated version, like <clears throat> <clears throat> I think these games came out after Sonic X was done, but it would have been fun to see these just in more uh, advanced animation and such. <clears throat> I will not be opposed to it. it sounds kind of nice, the idea, actually. Okay, mates, let's go and get those pirates. I think pretty much all Sonic Sonic shows these days are done in 3D animation. And I wouldn't mind that either. Or maybe I just want Blaze to finally show up in one of the, in one of the cartoons. <laughs> I think they went... 
Hmm. That way. No, let's hold back. Hmm? Why? No, what? Why? The waters ahead of here are too rough for this ship. Really? Up ahead are ice flows and other floating obstacles. This ship doesn't stand a chance. Hmm. Well, we'll just have to tempt fate then. Make sail. Ice flows, huh? What sort of vessel would we need then, Blaze? Well, the easiest way to avoid them would be you know, to just go right over them, but... All right, then. Just leave it to your captain. I'll come up with a plan. Hmm. A bit of hovercraft would probably work. Let me think for a sec. Let's, uh, huh? A hover? A hover what? Well, um, a hovercraft moves by floating just above the surface of the water. This way it can avoid things like floating obstacles and move through the shallows. Right, so if we had one of those, we'd be able to go after the pirates. A hovercraft, huh? Can you handle that, Thales? Sure, just leave it to me. With these materials, it'll be a snap. What's that? I got the material while we were, you know, when we were in that undersea cavern. And I got this other material while on the ghost ship. This one's particularly special. It gives off very powerful electromagnetic waves, making it especially useful. I see. This material must be the cause of the electrical current in these waters. Yes, but moreover, it's perfect for making our hovercrafts. Great. Tails, you're a genius. Hov hover oh fine, let's get on with the adventure a lot. <laughs> okay. Oh, dear. Do we have enough for that? Yep, the blueprints are finished. Yep. The ocean tornado can't pass through ice flows. Yep. Let's see. One blue, one iron, two green, two bronze, five red, and five silver. One short. One bronze. Uh. Okay, you know what? Off screen, since we won't start this game up again until Tuesday, I think I'm just going to run through the levels a good few times again just to make absolutely sure that we have enough of these for uh, next time. <clears throat> oh dear. You're not getting me to get back on that haunted ship again. <laughs> but if it, it's not because I'm afraid or anything, mate. <laughs> we need another craft to follow the pirates. Yeah, Blaze is going to be very to the point with everything she says, I'm pretty sure of that. Okay. And yeah, uh, I forgot to switch the scenes there again. <laughs> yeah, don't forget to save. Yeah. There and there. Good. Okay. Now the see the the map the, the world map with this isn't too big as you can see. Uh well. It's still pretty big, but yeah, <clears throat> it's not like we'll have to search around forever to find spaces. Like I'm pretty sure most of these small spots are going to be Johnny races or just hidden islands for extra materials. Actually, let's do a little heal. <laughs> yeah, okay. Three minutes remaining, like the yeah. rest. Okay, I won't go looking for islands. I will probably open a look for a map. <clears throat> or maybe I'll just open up my own copy, uh, physical copy of this game. It should still have to save. And I think I did explore basically everywhere on the map that was possible. And I can use that to see where the races are, where there's side islands, etc, etc. Okay. So, one more, one more to be sure. Okay. But, yeah. With that, we will have to call it for today, though. So, let me remove the always on top on this. And let's go look for someone to raid. So, let's see. Uh, I think we raid Rome's Fridge. No. Let's see, then. Um, 
I moved this away from the following thing. There. Let's, let me do, that's the alarm. The alert. Okay, let me change the screen share so Drakir can see. And let's have a look. So we have a lot of people online. Okay. Uh, so let's let's uh, narrow this down some. We have Lazarus who is playing Grim Dawn. We have Jimmy McGinger, no, Jimmy McGinger, hmm. who is playing Ape Escape. That's an um, old one. Let's see, that's an old one. I've heard plenty of it, but I've never actually played it. Same. I, I haven't played it, but I have seen people talk about it on a video. Okay. And then we have Sensei Tadpole, who is playing uh, Destiny 2. Okay. Any of those sound, or shall I take a pick? Oh, uh, we'll let you take a pick. Hmm. I think it's probably fitting that we just go Raid Lash. <laughs> he, is is. The, uh, he is the resident... Uh... Oh. Hold on, did I... Red Bull. Was that muted, or did I forget to mute that? Okay, I, okay, I, forgot, I, forgot, I forgot to hit the mute button. And luckily, the audio was low there, but it was just a stupid ad. So, if that was audible, sorry. <laughs> okay. Copy name. Uh, come on. Uh, why is it not showing chat? Or not? It's. Huh? Okay, for some reason on this. <laughs> On Twitch, it's not, it's not actually showing the chat bar for me. Like, it's showing the, the stream chat, but not where we can actually, well, type in. So, that's, uh, that's something. Let's try that again. Is it do with the... Okay. Weird. Is it with the terms of service or something? I don't think so. I think something is just glitching. But... Yeah, there should be stream chats next to my own bloody stream, but for some reason not. Oh well, we can always use the uh, chat over here from OBS. Hmm. And uh, yeah. Let's see. No stream tomorrow, likely. We could, we oh. could do a stream, but uh, we'll, we'll just have to see about that. Uh, maybe yeah. some Valheim, maybe something else. Just a big maybe on that. Yeah, mm. for the other ones uh, I talked about, uh, Valheim have been sort of uh, on Friday. We have to see. I haven't yeah. not heard what Durban Lord would have to say there yet. Okay. So I, I do suspect people are getting the ready for Easter. <laughs> Probably. And let's see, we are done with Partisans 1941. So that means that we're moving on to a new game on Saturday Strange Horticulture. Wait, what? I thought we were to do that on Sunday. Uh, yeah, I, I keep forgetting when we say stuff like that. And Sonic is getting impatient, it looks like, but... Uh, yeah, it, uh, we it, could put that after do... Shipbreaker. Which would you want us to do instead then on Saturday? We have uh, Retro Did Machina, say... Sang Freud and such. Did we say Indian Jones? Uh, I, w I was meaning that for possibly after Shipbreaker. Hmm. Aha, uh -huh. but the, the Alchemy game sounds like a Sunday game, while Indian Yom sounds like a Saturday game, if that makes sense. It doesn't really, but <laughs> okay, we'll see then what we'll play on Saturday. And that yeah, for, like, I'm a feeder. I don't care which all we do them for. I just thought that, that was the plan. <laughs> okay, but let's go with strange world. Uh, yeah, strange world of culture then. <clears throat> but right. yeah, for now though, uh, thank you everyone who's watching now or later. Let me see. Uh, no named lurkers according to the OBS chat at least. <clears throat> so uh, yeah, thank you, Rom, and thank you as always, Dr. here. You're welcome as always, my friend, and thank you all for watching. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, like I said, Strange Horticulture, we will finish Heart Space, the Heart Space Shipbreaker. I almost freaked it up with again <laughs> with the name. We will finish that on Sunday, very, very likely, unless there's, like, 
a, re oh, right. a really big last requirement for the ship doctor stuff. Oh, it's <sighs> good. We haven't technically finished Shipbreaker yet. Yeah, we have finished the story, but we have not finished the game yet. Do I think there's probably going to be a bit more story uh, just on that? But we'll have to see. <clears throat> Uh, yeah, before Sonic gets too impatient and he just quits like in the original game. Uh, thank you all again for watching. And let's actually get that raid started beforehand because I forgot that last time. <clears throat> yeah, thank you all again for watching. And until next time, have a nice day. And until then, be safe everyone, sleep well, and watch out for undead seagulls. And the seagulls around Southern Island. Ooh, South Island. <laughs> <laughs>